Uh, like, because we'll it right won't, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, because that causes the microphone. The microphone will. Oh, wait! No! Actually, I think the microphone's working again. Oh, okay. You, that, have to reset. I thought that was going to have to make me reset everything. Well, shit! Save! Hey, if it's working, it's working! I'm not gonna complain. They got to hear the glorious fall of microphone. Oh, uh, uh. That was an honor on their I part. I think it was, oh, well, I think, I think the cable got ripped out so they wouldn't have heard <laughs> anything when it was falling. <laughs> I'm just surprised I put the cable back in and the microphone started working again. Usually you have to reset things. Alright. But I guess not this mic. Okay! Puffwick, ick, covered with sand. I hate the sand. It's all icky and. Ah, uh, I hate sand. It gets all over the it place. It gets all over the place and. Rough and coarse. Rough and coarse. Ah, oh, what a barren place. Let's find a town before we shrivel up. But we, just, we just need clown music. I like, Edgar, you pithead! <laughs> I like, I like the, the, excuse me, there's sand on my boots! <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> I, like, I like the clouds and a lot of the effects. Yeah, those are simple but effective. Yeah. So, welcome to the desert. Alright. Alright. Time to meet whole new enemy types. This desert has all kinds of weird stuff in it, too. What are these? No, really, what are these? I've never in my life been able to figure out what they are. I think they're oyster shells. Fossils? Well, they're definitely supposed to be fossils, but uh, they look kind of like uh, snail shells a little bit, but they're not quite curly enough. Um, well, which way? North, south, east, or west? Uh, um, all of them. East. All? East? Yeah. They're definitely one of the uh, most fun things... Careful, those things can explode. Yeah, uh, one of the most fun things about the, the, the NES games... NES? Yep, and the, the NES and SNES was just making the bosses really mega big. That's my earliest memories in gaming was... It, uh, it took the a bosses. while for them to be able to do that. Yeah, it was, like, it was one of the big celebrations of Mega Man. Well, Mega Man actually kept the bosses small always, but they started having large enemies the with large Mega enemies. Man too. Yeah. Yeah, that was like, they have like a video on that, so just the how big that was at the time. Yeah. The gigantic enemies that you're fighting. Uh, but uh, my earliest memories Choose are like. Choose a direction. Uh, I guess up again. Uh, Yoshi's Island. We just take a common enemy and just blow it up to the side <laughs> of the bar. Uh, and um, Lagoon, of course, was just one of my all-time favorites. Yeah. Same, same thing. Except something so simple. Because the game only really has a few things going for it. Uh, really, really good music. Really good music. I like the dungeons. Elfland music. The, ju theme. the jumping. Um, and they're these mega-sized bosses. I don't think the jumping would sell too many people. Oh, I just remember it. He had the cape yeah. on, and he always looked cool jumping. He does, and then he insta dies a whole bunch because Nazar just insta dies a whole bunch because the mist jumps. Well, you know, you first encounter that first spot in Philip's castle, and you're like, no, <laughs> fall through for the bridge. Oops, <laughs> uh, that was you. You pushed. Okay, oh, okay. Is it, yeah, but you you, because you're player one, you have it, uh, all the controls. Well, it's just so sad. You just walk across the bridge and <laughs> gone. Yep. <laughs> They're like, well, that happened. Well, have you figured out where you're going yet? Um, east. You want to go east? Fucking ant lions. Ack, I'm trying to fight this thing. There we go. Okay. You want to go east this time? Yeah. Okay. We just try directions. Oh, go back to the shells. Oh. Don't so dry. I can't go on. We're fi it's infinite. Okay. It's got all this variety to it, but it's actually not any location. <laughs> oh, okay. It just, you pass a certain number of screens, and then it just does this. Okay. That's actually scripted. So you might feel like you're lost in the desert, because you are lost in the desert. Look, over there, hurry! Ah. Ow. You got us, you sneaky little thing, you. Oh. 
Ah, okay. there we go. Alright, time to heal. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, this seems like a good time for healing. I'm gonna switch weapons again. Why am I using the axe but, uh, still? Yeah, but I don't think the biggest innovation... I could be using the punchy gloves. Um, I think the biggest thing in game design for me will always be uh, Miyamoto. Make, make, control make the, the controls fun. fun. Yeah. A ship! Um, and it was later, through watching a whole bunch of game tech videos, that they revealed it's called the Core Loop. What a lifesaver! You, what are you doing here? Only Imperial spies could be so stupid! I feel like we're in Final Fantasy 2. Just, uh, boarding the Sir, we picked up some spies! Hold on, maybe they just got lost. You know. <laughs> We'd almost give it up. I like you, so I'm gonna help you. You'll work the engines, and the shrimp will make the meals, and she comes with me. <laughs> you heard a move! Yeah, boarding uh, military vessels. Always a bright idea. Get to work. Oh boy, I'm employed. Ah, she blows, eh? You're new, huh? I'm Sergo, pirate and scourge of the eight seas. Or at least I used to be. The oceans have grown too stormy. I stowed away because I missed my ship so much. Wonder if the oceans will ever be safe again. Oh, you want to escape with your friends? Leave it to me. Go talk to those guards by the stairs. That was quick. The escape was, like, right there next to me. People picked up on the desert are slaves. This is the Republic's secret sand ship. This is the Republic, by the way, not the Empire. These are theoretically the guys we're on the side oh, of, maybe. this is the Jedi. Okay. Maybe. <laughs> uh, we have literally... Admiral Morel's in command, but his grandson, Mori, calls the shots. Mori would just as soon dump him in the desert. Go ahead. Well, I, I just find it ironic that uh, the Star Wars prequel literally has the Republic and the Empire. Because I don't think the Republic existed in the first three Star Wars movies. No, no, the it first... It just Rebels. Well, the, okay, so... Ah, my gosh, going into a whole different thing. So, the Republic at Coruscant ruled over uh, yes. uh, stuff of the Council. There was no Empire. Then, the Emperor... No, no, Palpatine, no, 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 it's just the rebels. The Empire, yeah, yeah, during the first three movies, that's when they introduced the concept of the Republic. Uh, and so I here mean, we are. I think it was. In, I mean, I'm pretty sure it was in the novels before the uh, movies. Yeah, but it could be in the novels. I don't know about the novels. But I'm just going to go yeah. here. The game with both literally the Republic and I'm like, oh, we're actually. Yeah, there's 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 multiple countries. There's a Republic. There's an Empire. There's uh. No, 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 yeah, I just find it funny here. It's just like, yeah, we are Star Wars. There's some kingdoms. This is the unofficial Star Wars movie that we're missing here. Fire! Fire! <laughs> What? Out of our way! You're taking me too seriously when I'm trying to sit, tell stupid jokes. I see. <laughs> I have escaped the engine room. Yeah, not for long. I have a they sword, got, um, and uh, an uh, axe, and a boomerang. What can you all do? According to uh, uh, Red Dwarf, they've got big whips. Massive, <laughs> massive whips. Massive, massive I'm whips. I'm not building any pyramids. I don't know. the greatest motivator of all time. You know, I don't think that any of the later Mana games have a lot of tech in them. But in Secret of Mana, they have these crazy ship, uh, mechanical ship things. Yeah. It still kind of feels Final Fantasy-esque. Well. Oh, but that's all the magic tech going on. And later ones just kind of, kind of go more and more fantasy. I mean, yeah, the magic tech, yeah, hmm. But yeah, starting with Seika Tetsu 3, I don't think you see any tech anymore. Mm -hmm. uh, well, you, you brought them back to the Dark Ages. That's what happened. Stop lollygagging! <sighs> Just like paradise in here, eh, buddy? He ate all the ship's food! Is that your friend? Show him out of here! What even happened here? <laughs> Couldn't eat another thing! <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Points for randomness. You get captured by slavers. <laughs> uh, your buddy just goes and raids the kitchen. How did this even happen? They're the worst. He was told to work in the kitchens, and so he went there and he ate everything. And apparently, they do a very poor job of managing the slaves. And you can just eat all the food with no repercussions. Wander about at will. <laughs> You're doing great, guys. You're doing really great. Oh my gosh, I don't know where to go. 
Let me see. So that led to there. So I guess there's no way I can get to the helm from here. So somewhere. Gotta go find uh, Prim next. Yeah, we have to find the lady. Medic! Medic! Uh, where, oh, where do I go? There we go. There's some place to go. Okay, so this is this is yeah. This was just a dead end. Okay. So that I don't really know. Hmm. I, I finally know what this game is missing. What? Doctor Ivo Robotnik. Doctor Ivo Robotnik. <laughs> yep. Okay. I definitely don't want to go back there. Uh, It'd be funny. You go back down there. Game over. You got recaptured. You're one, you're one chance to escape. <laughs> Why would you go back to the hold? Hey, you wander around for a minute. Okay. All right. I'll just uh, double huh. check this guide over here. Uh, um. Okay. The guys with the door. The man with the banana twice. Guards will escape, head outside the ship, go downstairs, find Sprite, eating all the food. Yep, did that. Finally, head to the door in the middle of the ship. Oh, there's a door in the middle of the ship. Oh! Oh, obviously. Oh, I didn't even see the door. <laughs> I didn't see it! It was right in front of our faces, and I Blended did right not in. see it. How did I fail to see the obvious door? Sure. Um... What? Uh, you're not bothered at all. I'm just wandering around. There's no, there's no security. There's nothing. <laughs> security? What's that? Hmm. <sighs> Help! Rats have eaten all the food. <laughs> That's Sprite again. Sprite's the MVP on this one. We're finished. <laughs> no. <laughs> Rats, huh? <laughs> <laughs> and you believe me? <laughs> I think Sprite is the fan favorite character for a reason. Yeah. In the third game, it's uh, the uh, guy with two knives is the fan favorite character. I think his name was Hawk. Yeah. My <laughs> my favorite character was uh, actually uh, my, actually I'm fond of several of them, but it's always gonna be uh, Lise, the uh, spear Amazon lady. Ah. She was the first character I played as. Massage my actually, back. Actually, then again, I think Angela might be the fan favorite character. <laughs> I'm actually not sure. <laughs> Angela's pretty good too, though. Massage my backs. But I'd rather have my gums scraped. That's a weird expression. <laughs> Spoiled brat. I ought to... I mean, asking for a massage isn't even that big a deal. I don't know. I don't know massage people, not that big a deal. Maury, how dare you? were you? literally saved from dying in the desert, and they asked... They, they, they actually... I mean, you know, forced labor is not good and all, but you didn't pay for a ticket on this cruise either, and instead you immediately eat all their food, scream fire, panic them in the engine room, they're like, how dare you ask for a massage? Like, you were dying in the desert. Holy shit, guys. We're the good guys, right? I don't know. Just checking, just checking. We're still the good so. guys? Okay, we're still the good guys. It's not like the Empire's gonna conquer the world or evil or Manafort. No, no, we can just ruin the Republic's secret sand ship. It's not a... They don't need a military anyway. We'll just start some random fires. But, but Grandpa... Oof, you're pathetic. Woman, get out of here! <laughs> my name's Medic. <laughs> oh, am I glad to see you. They've escaped! That's all your fault, Gramps. Uh, or escapees, grab them! <laughs> it's Gramps' fault they escaped? How? Oh. The translation's not the best. <laughs> you idiot, you're no soldier to arms! <laughs> How awkward. Okay, boss fight? Yeah, the Empire is attacking the ship. Oh, them again. Yep, see them? Yep. So there's Empire, there's Spandex. not Empire. And you can just catch the Surrender! Top Nuts! <laughs> That's the dialogue. Surrender! Nuts! <laughs> <laughs> this, is definitely, this is definitely amazing. 10 out of 10. 
Ha ha! Ah, hey, we met this guy once, remember? He's the lead villain. Yeah, and he's just there. <laughs> or is <laughs> Didn't think I'd see you here. You must be the one Thanos warned me about. Or wait, or maybe this is our first time meeting him. That's a second. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> How about a little game? I dropped you off to go fight another random monster? No, it's him. Oh, is it him? It's him. Oh, okay. Yep. Uh, okay, at least he didn't engage in the... Oh, I did not press the button. Yep, so careful, he charges in straight lines and gets you with his lance. Yep. Uh, well, that's unfortunate. Sprite, you okay over there? Can, can you, can you, thank you. Oh, oh, there we go. Get him! Looks like you got him. Yeah, this always made me think of Zelda 2 with the, uh, boss that's on the, uh, horse that goes back and forth. Yeah, I can definitely see that. Yeah, that's what it reminded me of as a kid. Also, he has missiles. Midnight's looking a little bit weird. <laughs> Ow, missiles. You think a robot with blonde hair. I like his fiery uh, tassel on his helmet. You should heal us. Alright. Drink! I provide the water of healing. Yes, level two. Do you mind not charging when the mill's stabbing you? Missiling us. Yes, now he'll be on the other side of the screen again. Cursed thing. Sprite! Sprite, get up and pick your sword up. Oh shit. Ow. Alright, you know what? Let's see how you like ice. Okay, that didn't hit very hard. Maybe we should have analyzed him. Oh well. Probably lightning robot. Oh yeah, lightning. Just you know, thinking. Good here. point. Yeah, nobody ever thinks to put rubber in a robot. No, I didn't do it. Oh, okay, the Earth is all flat. Let's throw a rock at him. Ow, I'm dead. He seriously killed me. That's okay. I got him. With a rock. <laughs> Throw a rock at the engine. We had done most of the damage by just punching and kicking and stabbing and all that. Yay! Well, I'm there in spirit, I guess. <laughs> Could have done a little better. Way to go! Got the whip is orb. That's good, I like the whip. <coughs> oh. What a mess! Everyone's run away. But your Jemma's friends. Uh, well, I must apologize for my grandson's <laughs> actions. I almost forgotten how true soldiers oh, act. Oh, just you know, it's just that easy. You go up to that, you immediately forget. Oh, my beautiful ship! Shameful. So the Republic no longer has a secret sand ship. <laughs> yeah, that's I, fine. I like that they, they didn't they need one. All, they get out a secret ship and they immediately forget all, all <laughs> courtesy, all how to act as a soldier, all everything. Just all went out the window. Yeah, well, it got us you know where we need to go. <laughs> no more no if you need jobs! What, what do you mean? He's, a, need he's, jobs? A, he's a pirate. He'll, he'll give us jobs on his pirate ship. I gotta talk to somebody. No way to go. Hmm. Yeah, well, yeah, 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 we went to that. Uh, time to escape rope. Well, rescue team's come on, you're leaving? Okay. Try to stay out of those. Bad things happen when you fall in them. Uh, I just had an auto follow. Right. Go, 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 go! Alright! Auto follow. Oop. There we go. Welcome to Kakara! Yay! Salamando's gone! He lived in the Fire Palace! Ah! You think this fire palace and Salamando is important because random people are blurting his name out? 
Nah, probably not. <laughs> We only came here to visit the Fire Palace. It's, it's funny because probably half, not important. Half the time, the game doesn't tell you where to go or what to do. It but it usually tells you where to go and what to do. But, I mean, there's yeah. a cannon there, it's just messing up. And the cannon failing. He told us where to go and what to do, and then, then the he did it. Didn't work. Didn't work. <laughs> I I think that was a ROM issue. And then you had to talk I, I to that know. random woman to start this quest line uh, with the people who didn't talk. With one of the guys with the mask over their head. Oh, that was that was. Yeah, to talk to another random NPC. Water. I need water. Um, mm. We've been complaining about the few times it's come up, and here they're, they're being very hyper specific. Yeah. Yeah. Our water's gone, and some guy named Jama said that the mana seed's power has been stolen. And these two things are not related, by the way. Yeah, I mean, it's fire seed. Fire seed shouldn't have anything to do with the water problems. Yeah, you're not going to fix their water that way. Someone's nabbed Salamando, keeper of the fire palace. What's more, the fire seed is gone, so, so the fire spirit's gone, the fire seed has been messed up, and they don't have water anymore. Yeah, yeah. Do you think they'd have more water with the fire seed being missing? <laughs> uh, that actually would be entertaining the area just becomes flooded. Yeah, no, it, there's, um, there's actually a thing you can get. Um, it's actually a completely optional, uh, easy to miss side quest where you can get this town its water again. Ah. But it's basically a hidden secret. Ah. You gotta end the drought. You gotta yeah. attack the uh, drought in its weak point. You stamped it in its weak point. So we've got this guy here. Um, so we could go do the fire palace. Yeah. Or we could go to ice country. Alright. Ah, screw this place. I'm going to the ice country now. Yippee. Blew up a sand ship. That's what we really came here to do. Isn't should, uh, it? should we get any fur coats or anything? So you're... No, you'll be fine. You'll be fine. Look, in Code Veronica, she can casually lean against metal objects with yep. her bare flesh in the freezing cold. So you'll be fine. Yeah, yeah. It, 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 I'm like, uh, that drove me crazy. Like, you animators, you actually animated the model doing that. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way you would make that animation and not think about, wait a minute, bare skin, metal, freezing conditions. Yeah, let me see if we can buy any gear. Yeah, hot Kool-Aid for volcanoes and um, uh, room temperature snow. <laughs> room temperature ice. Room temperature ice. <laughs> it just, it's just how it goes, you know. I'm this town's blacksmith. Who's this creep? <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, Watts well, just moves into places. Yeah, I, he's just like, I'm here now. <laughs> I, I ask you to leave our premises, you can't make me. <laughs> uh, too bad. Yeah, your town, town security is uh, lax. I don't think you ever see too many, well, I mean, most of man, you see all kinds of things, but I don't think you see too many walrus people in uh, Seiken Tetsu 3. Well, not in video games in general, yeah. Well, we can try kind of this a place. Rare, rare combination. I mean, there's one in um, um, Game Boy Zelda. Ah, Silver Band. Yeah, that's about it. Cause I gotta get just that rare. Uh, cat people everywhere. Wolf people everywhere. Golden vests. Walrus people, not so much. Ooh, this stuff's expensive. Let's see, raccoon cap or golden tea raccoon caps? Naturally! Yeah, yeah. Who doesn't want to look like a raccoon? We're gonna bury ourselves in the snow, at least no raccoons. Alright, let's gear up and head on out. From 10 to 21. I tell ya. Jumps in the gear a bit, bit big. <laughs> yeah, except for the, the uh, amulet things. Yeah, those seem to be stuck on two still. But this this time oh, we get know. real helmets. Not pay, uh, playing the game without getting the upgrades. Without the armor? Yeah. Impossible! You know some lunatic out there has done it somewhere. Uh, just take care of the... Uh, take advantage of the... All I have to do is not get hit, and then I'll win! Make every boss flinch. I wonder what I don't know what a secret of mana speed run looks like. <laughs> I probably just I, I just imagine them oh. taking care of endless flinching. Oh, oh yeah, the uh, gloves. Yeah, I can knock them unconscious with this one. 
and then just doing crazy stuff with the magic, finding the most broken magic. Oh, uh, well, we'll it would to, be we'll to, yeah, it would be about the spell casting probably. We'll oh my gosh, that just did a hundred damage to me even in one with our hit. Armor upgrade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Watch out for these guys. We were, we were we were told to go to the desert, and I decided screw it. I'm going to go to the ice area. When we go back to the desert, it's going to be great. <laughs> we got all this armor. We're going to have to sick the spiffing bird on this. See what he comes up with. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> He's got nothing. Perfectly balanced game. Yeah. Like all games should. Be. He's got nothing. There's no. Ow. 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 Can you not die while I'm opening a chest? I'm trying, but I, I have I have the gloves equipped, which requires me to get uncomfortably close to the enemy. I mean, you could equip the whip. I mean, I could. We just upgraded it. But I'm knocking them unconscious. And then they hit me with a freaking speed down. Alright. But knocking them unconscious is pretty good. Alright. <laughs> Bop! Great. You got Moogled too? No, I got uh, knocked unconscious. Ah, okay. Yeah, Riot Gas just does a random status effect. I don't know what it does. Not poison, though. Or maybe. But I don't think it does poison. I got turned into a Moogle randomly. Yeah. You could be shrunk. Okay. Yeah, the knocking unconscious is pretty good, isn't it? When it works. I'm not sure what the advantage of knocking unconscious does, though. The, the enemy just lies on the ground, and you can just walk up and finish it. Uh, You've seen me do it, like, a whole bunch of times. There, it's unconscious, see? It's just laying there. Yeah, but... Oh, uh, well, now this one got back up. Usually they just stay laying there. Yeah, there's Rudolph. Now help! My master's gone! No, no one's in the ice palace except a monster! The monster's got master! Help! Yep. I remember our last, last ice palace. It's kind of a bit random. We got the spears orb for you. Oh, wait a sec. We got another spears orb for you. That's two levels to the spear. Yay! That was huge! Very yeah, I don't powerful very spear. Very no, no, it increases the base attack power oh, okay, every time okay. we upgrade it. Okay. Yeah, you can see how when I knock them unconscious, they tend to stay that way for a bit. It's pretty good. Okay. Yes, their evasion is very high. That one's going on. Okay, not that way. Well, no. <laughs> it sucked in. <laughs> Too late. Look at fault. these beautiful crystal trees. Like we want for like they actually can constantly am changing the terrain. Yeah. That's a beautiful game. Yeah, it really is. Yeah, and that's without dispute. Crystal stuff, like all this. But man, in Legend of Mana, they go really all out with well, the freaking. Everything is hand drawn in that one. Everything is hand painted, and everything has motion to it. Everywhere you go, every screen, there's just things moving. Yeah, knocked all of them out. You should probably heal. Um, okay, I'm gonna hit the heal sprite. Work. No, no, uh, yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, you just leveled up. Oh, so you fully healed. Yeah, you were low, low on hit points. Oh, I didn't notice. Okay, that thing can't be attacked with anything other than spells. Alright. So, for that... But the big advantage on the previous Wait, title... Wait, did I just throw it, ice at the you freaking have to be ice cloud? weapons to move and navigate. Yeah, I mean, there's a little bit of that sometimes, like the whip to cross a thing, but it's... It's Less more intrusive. like a spice than, you know, a central gameplay mechanic. Yeah, switch the equipment 15 times per dungeon. Yeah, Sword of Mana had a serious issue with that. And the weapons didn't really feel all that different in it. Um, I mean, the only could... one that felt different was the, the, uh, the, ball, the 
wrecking ball. Yeah. Spike. Cause I had some and death all killer. the spells were just the same spell. <laughs> Couldn't even provide separate animations for them. Well, you know. Okay, I leveled up the glove. Finally! Alright, I'm gonna switch to the whip. I couldn't get over the jumping, the enemies jumping, and they're just it's like they're flat on the ground, but somehow. Wasn't that the first game? Yeah. Yeah, that was the original, not the uh. uh yeah, the, the original. Mm. Uh We're gonna run out of MP. Yeah, I can't believe my first reaction was to cast ice on something. The freaking ice thing. It's like, no wonder that didn't kill it. Uh, you know. <coughs> this place just needs a little bit more ice in it. Okay. So. It's a tad bit lost. Oh. Well, I mean, we're just wandering around a random area we're not supposed to be. I yep. mean, okay. you know. <laughs> it's fine. It's just a peaceful episode. We're just nonchalantly getting ripped apart. Yep, and we've got uh, Flammy flying around again. Yep. So if, um, if Flammy ever needs parents, just go here, you know? Plenty plenty of Flammies to go around. Or maybe Can't it's too low. Oh, boss. Oh, yeah, you would heal us. Yeah, that was my first thought. I'm like, uh-oh. That wasn't part of the plan. Uh, yeah, I forgot about this. It's okay. It's, it's an easy one. Oh. Is it, is it the plant again? Yeah. Only it... Things are a little different this time. I mean, it's an embarrassingly easy boss. Well, but the environment's kind of different now. Let me see. Wind cutter! One damage. Well, right. that wasn't very good. Not quite. Uh, go ahead and hit it with analyzer next time it pops up. Let's see what you got. 900 hit points left, 12 MP, no weaknesses. Hmm. Oh, it's got a lot of damage to do to it still. Alright, I'm gonna try throwing a rock at it. That seems to be our best spell. Ow. And I'm gonna throw another rock at it before. And then I'm gonna throw another rock at it. And then I'm going to throw another rock at it. And you know what I'm going to do after that? I'm going to cast Gem Missile on it. And you know what I'm going to do after that? It's going to the ground. Gem Missile. I mean, what else am I supposed to do? Uh -huh. But throw all my spells at it. And finally, I'm going to freeze it. I don't know, why not? Okay. So I pummeled it with a ton of MP and wasted our freaking thing. But, you know, once you've spent the walnut, you better get your money's worth out of it. Yeah. Hmm. So I'd estimate, I don't know how much damage we did after scanning it, but at the way I'm doing it, about 18 hits. Not touching it, but I'm still taking damage. Bullshit. Okay, I'm gonna give it a good whack. You're not that big. Um. Okay, I did get the hit in. Yeah, I was trying to tell you not to hit it till my mind connected. <laughs> I'll give it a big whack. Yeah, I'm getting 130 with those. Yeah, I mean, really good. Ow. Yeah, well, it's charged up to level 3, so... Okay, it's got to be nearing death. Yeah. Down, 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 down. Alright, I'm going to hit it. 
Ow. It's dead lock. I was ten locked into just being hit and hit and hit. And hit. Like, yeah. Well, you know, as I said, not quite the same as the previous battle with it. Yeah. Still a joke. Compared to other bosses. Well, I mean, compared to some of the other bosses. That freaking snake. Snake? I'm a tiger. I'm everywhere. I'm around. everywhere. Yeah. Bows, orbs. We got two spear upgrades and a bow upgrade. Any boss that has to right. to death is terrible. And in the middle of the frozen wasteland, we find... Welcome to the tropics! Makes sense to me. Where else would you put your Everyone tropics? Everyone here has deep pockets! Even kings are dazzled by this place! They were oh. telling us about this in the desert. It's hot here, even when it's snowing outside. This is where all the wealthy people are, they say. I'm surprised we're not being snubbed for being poor. <laughs> people covered in blood. We have a ton of money. Yeah. I moved from Gold City! It's in to own a second house here. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, I guess we found where... This uh, place is gonna be gorgeous! I guess we found a retirement home area. Our resort's a hit. We're like slaves here. What? Where'd that come from? <laughs> Oh, uh, but remember, the green, you've seen the green noodly arm people before. Whoops, wrong way. No, 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 no. This nope. is where we want to be. Back to work. Don't want to fight the turtles. We remember the turtles from the yeah. first game. Yeah, but it took the spike to take them on. Yeah. You can't beat this place. Why would we? <laughs> so glad my wife found this place. We just start beating the place. We just start attacking. No, them. what are you doing? <laughs> Money is better than mana! <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Uber snobby. Ah, who are you? Haven't we met? Oh well, watch this stove. Just whack it if it cools down, okay? <laughs> Does everyone just know something so nonchalant? A stranger comes in caked in mud, um, dressed weird with some weird people. Oh yeah, yeah, I just take a take deal with whatever this is. I hear something. Shall I open? Oh, it? that's where Salamander is. Okay. Shall I open Pandora's stove? <laughs> Hello, Salamander. I should have figured it out earlier. Oh, thanks. <laughs> yep, he went missing. Yeah. How dare those creatures use me as a heater? Now I'm gonna teach you the power of fire. Okay, that actually made sense. I think it's uh, us. Uh, I just thought it was just more low random. <laughs> You again? Didn't you recognize them? Oh, uh, sorry. <laughs> okay, okay, the villains. Okay. Everyone's gone. I was about to become rich. The fire of the seat, I haven't a clue. I saw an odd old guy when we nabbed Salamando. Don't help them. <laughs> See ya, bye. Don't even fight you again. Okay. <laughs> they just they're... We didn't fight them last time. They just threw a robot at us and Team then Rocket's ran just away. Kind of a bit. You know? Yeah, they're just some random guys. Okay, so check out your new magic. This is the most important magic you gain in the game that's not healing. Alright. You have Flame Saber, which is self-explanatory, Blaze Wall, and Fire Bouquet. Both of those are attack spells. Okay. During bosses, you can now throw attack at them. Well, I need to recharge on magic because apparently I'm very low. Oh, well, yeah, I know. Well, we're just going to have to get out of here. I've got Fireball, Lava Wave, and Explosure! Explosure. EXPLOSION! Yeah. Yes. Running, 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 running. We could, we, secretly we've been in Konosuba the entire time. I will admit that was, that was a cute plot. I will give the point for that. <laughs> that was unexpected and a bit funny. It's like, you never know what you're going to find in this game. And I think that city is is great. Yeah. It's, it's now completely abandoned. Yeah. Just uh, the one green city. Yeah. <laughs> so when we get back, we're going to upgrade the spear twice. So that'll massively up your attack power. We've got access to fire magic, which is what we came here for. And now we can just go back to the desert and, you know, do our thing. We can make the desert hotter. We're gonna turn it into glass. Ah, yes. Yeah. Make sure you don't get stranded, gee. Well, I wonder what that would be like. <laughs> stranded in the desert. 
Mm. Well, we went from one desert to another. The frozen desert to the mm. regular desert. Ah, yes, of course. Yeah, we're, we're leaving Siberia. <laughs> we just landed on the guy. Ah, he's fine. He when you hat. land on the bees in Gaia's Navel, they actually take damage. I just like to hit. It's a very soft hat. Yeah. You cushioned our fall. Welcome to Kakara. Kakara. Yeah. Um, it's a little heavy on the Ks there. Alright. Let's restore our MP. Unfortunately, your fire magic is currently level zero. Yay! I kind of think what it should be is just level up your magic across the board. Because, I mean, nobody likes getting to Dryad and being like, it's level zero at the end of the game. You mean like Lagoon, where you, you have the, the wand and the crystals, and so every time you get the wand upgrade, you, the crystals are automatically leveled up with it? Yeah. It's kind of nice getting all the end game magic all at once. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so... We need to go find ourselves a fire palace yeah. for the fourth seed. So we're going to go back. And then to... magic can go to level. So when we find the fire palace, do we need the Boncho fan? Wait. Yeah, fourth seed. Fourth seed. Uh, nope, sorry. Not mountain. <laughs> Stop playing with rock, Sprite, and get over here. Oh. Mad Mallards have made their appearance. Now, now we're in my RPG. I recognize the Shining Stars. Oh, yeah. Star Hill. Yeah. So, uh, they summon the freaking pumpkin bombs that explode, and they throw eggs that explode, and... Well, you know, it's just a duck with a helmet other than that. Yeah, it's just a other than bad. all the explosives. Uh, I mean, they, they saw the non-duck cartoons in the, in the military, and they were inspired. <laughs> I guess I have no idea. Hmm. I, I can't go north. It's blocking me. So I guess I go. No, can't go that way. I go south. Hmm. I guess. All right. I I guess. I'm gonna try going um, north from here if it can be done. Well, that takes us back to the town now. Okay, yeah, this is a no. Okay, then I guess we have to go south. Yeah. Okay, then. Well, alright then. Lead us, lead us. Oh, no. We're, we're in the circle. I can't go east or south. Hmm. I'm gonna go back to the village and I'm gonna ask for directions. Alright, escape rope. Might as well throw all my. What would you. Sprite, I asked you to do something. Hoping for some good target practice. Sprite! There you go. Gotcha. Alright. Oh, leveled up. Exploder. Oh, he moved north. Yeah, he's getting out. Yeah, exploder costs more than more MP than the uh, other spells we've been flinging around. Not that much more, but more. Not time to sleep away all our problems. Yep. So we're gonna just talk to some the, the chief and see if we can figure out where to go again. Cause I I'm not. I feel like it should have been north of that star field. I thought. I'm just here for the ride. I'm just, uh, I got my pointy stick. I'm happy. Um. I oh, just... yeah, let's upgrade that. I forgot it. 
<laughs> that tree somehow blocked me. I just like how it caused the, the character to do all sorts of weird movement with the tree. Palace to the west. Hmm. Palace to the west. I went west, right? Yeah, you went east. No, I went east. Oh, shit, west. West! I went east. Okay, that's... Okay. <laughs> All right. The west meme is true. So, the spear... Upgrading. This is cheap. Upgrading. All right. So, now that thing should hit pretty hard. Yay! I'll be back to being relevant. Yeah, that, that should have massively increased its power to the point where, uh... There it is. Yeah! That's an axe. No, oh, that's, that's the spear! spear. Well, it doesn't look like a spear anymore. <laughs> it's a pole arm. <laughs> it looks like an axe to me. It's, got it's an axe head. on a stick! <laughs> axe on a stick there. Um. Yes. I don't think it ever takes the form of a proper halberd, but, uh... Hmm, let me let me check one thing. There's not a path directly west, right? Yeah, gotta be sure on that one. Just checking, just checking. I didn't think there was, but you know, it's been a long time, and I've forgotten a lot of things. And I remember the hard bosses. <laughs> yep. I remember the tiger. I remember the snake. I remember the werewolves. Uh, yeah, the werewolves really got us. <laughs> the werewolves got us pretty good. That has been the most difficult if you thing do thus it, far. If you do it right, you can have all three characters when you fight them. But, you know, I didn't do it right. <laughs> I didn't. I couldn't find where the goblins... Uh, but we still got crushed. That was, like, the most devastating battle. Yep. Hmm... Right. In the third game, you can play as one of those werewolves. Oh, we're in the right place now. Oh, yep. Yeah. And we got the important bomb playing. Yeah. The song of the sea. Yeah, those things will stick their stinger in the sand and will come out underneath you. Mm. Definitely a lot of burrowing enemies. Yep. In the soft sands. You better heal Sprite now. <laughs> you mind? Oh, Chobin Hood is trying to attack us from above. While spiders come at you from below. Right. Uh, we're getting hammered on what all sides. What a gnarly area. Alright. Welcome to the fire palace where they will shoot us with fire arrows. Ow. So, uh, Flame Saber, among other things, sets people you hit on fire. I know that's your favorite uh, thing. Right. Oh, shit. Uh, kill the slime first. Okay. Oh, dear. Yeah, um... <laughs> this could be going better. Alright, um... Um... Not fire magic. <laughs> well... Okay, uh, cast, um, go back. Go to Gnome, cast Stone Saber on yourself. Okay, well, the duration will be shit then. Let me heal. Sprite. You're dying! Oh! You died! You're too slow. Yeah, once they're petrified, the fight's over. Help! Help! I'm dead. That was embarrassing. I got... Wow. I was just frozen in place until I died. Hmm. For some reason I can't hit them when I'm down here. This That's unlocking annoying. is so terrible. Yeah, it can be. I go from half health, full health, to dead. Yeah. 
All right, let's see what we got. I think I have some cups. All right. Um, instead of the Goblet of Fire, it's the Goblet of Life. Yeah. Oh, we're in the Goblet of Fire. Ooh, oh. Talk about flames. Yeah, we're, we're in Super Mets right now. Uh, let me see. We need, like, a suit to put on to deal with the heat. Looks like you're playing a sprite. No, um, I think I knocked out. Ooh, there we go. I'm back to control myself. Weird. Okay. Uh, you're gonna have to analyze that over there. Okay. Alright. You try looking at it. You try sniffing it. You try licking it. It's gonna be exploding. Alright, fire. Yep. So, what I need to use specifically is EXPLOSION! And after we cast the Dragon Slave... There we go. And somehow the lava disappeared. Makes we sense blew to me. it out. With the explosion. <laughs> exactly. I don't know what's so confusing about that. Seems straightforward. Follows physics to me, right? Yeah! You, you, you use an explosion and the lava stops being lava. I mean, obviously. Yeah, the other thing about the whip is you can hit multiple targets, whereas I think the bow and the uh, javelin can only hit, like, one target. Mm. Poor slime. Okay. He's getting beat Ooh. down. Okay, okay. Well, we just stomped it into the ground. Alright, so we've got up the stairs or down. Let's try... Oh, no! Ha! <laughs> oh! I apologize. Oh! That hurt! Okay. Well, uh, that was a surprise. We're gaining weapon levels left and right. Uh, oh, was... shit. Heal. I'm stuck. Uh, yeah, we're on fire. We're in a world of hurt now. Uh, okay. Sprite, Sprite. You tried. Let me out! Okay. Alright, just run to the exit. Right. Yeah, that was, um, right, holy this crap. Time, this time we're not going down. I think this is our last cup of wishes. Probably. Just don't die. Okay, that looks like no magic, but go ahead and analyze it just to be sure. Alright. I don't want to waste MP. No, no, you gotta use analyzer. Okay. Yeah, I don't want to waste any MP. Well, I waste MP every time I analyze. One. Yeah. I uh, it costs like four. Salamander's magical work. Yep. So I was wrong. It's a good thing we checked. Because <laughs> I would have blown three MP on a Salamando spell. Or I mean a gnome spell. Uh, did anything happen? Um let me try fireball. That was it. Oh, uh, that's a specific spell. Yes. If that hadn't worked, you'd have had to start casting fire. Ow. Ow. Okay. Everyone's good on health, so I'm gonna leave that alone. Cup of wishes, please. No. Never that lucky. No. One up, so we don't give them away like candy. Mm. Yeah, let's avoid it. Yeah, we don't have the MP to spend on those. Alright. Well. Fighting for a chest, I yeah. see. We were in a slot. slot okay, there. that was important. Yeah, you don't want to miss the orbs because, you know, it permanently leaves a weapon behind. Oh, yeah, we, the game orbits around them. Let's 
Sprite, stop messing around. He's having the time of his life there. And Sprite! Move! Don't need to heal anybody just yet. Uh, um, this way. Just find stairs, go downstairs. Don't ask questions. Yep, definitely need some big dungeons. Mm. Uh, but I must say, I, I prefer Zelda dungeons. Ah, finally! That, that knocked away a wall. Yeah, this is where we all died earlier. Cross. Yay. Oh. Right. Okay. Analyzer. All right. Analyzer. I'm gonna guess fire. <laughs> you think? Nope. Undying. Okay. Uh huh. I'm just gonna stab it a bunch. Until it decides to work. Alright, I'm going to have to use one of our... We only got two left. And me? Oh no, it's right, okay. You're gonna need one too. Soon. You're almost out of MP. I said ice it. She's not as responsive... The, 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 the characters, neither of them are as responsive yeah. with spells as they should be. Yeah, and it's a little clunky. Two are left standing. How embarrassing. Sprite, you didn't do your job. There it goes. <laughs> Bit of a delay. Boss? Yep. Oh, Minotaur. Earth slide level seven. Ow. Okay, you can uh, use your fairy walnut. Yeah, yeah, you got one healing left in ya. Um, so go ahead and, yeah, use a fairy walnut and then analyze this thing. I think lightning, uh, I think it's horns should attract lightning bolts. Alright. Alright. Uh, oh. Hello. Tell me your weaknesses. Yes. Lightning. Alright. Yeah, he's so big. Ow. Yeah, he picks you up, slams you down, because he's, he's a wrestler. Pro wrestler. Hey, I'm unconscious. Yeah, he did. And I better heal, like, immediately. Right! Yeah. Timing. Ow! Did you not? Yes, he just pulled a JoJo's he on you. He just did it. He did the two fingers. <laughs> he did the two fingers. Um, I felt, I felt like curling for a moment there on Priest's horns. Unfortunately, we're out of um, MP and life. He's physically dead. Like, Is he? Not, he's yeah. turned red, and he's getting faster and angrier. He only had a thousand two hundred points to begin with. Oh, okay. How many he got left? Um, Don't less die than, because we have no way to fix you. Oh shit! Why don't you cast um, Thunder Sword Saber on us? All right. Yeah. You're constantly doing 200 damage. There is going to definitely be. Uh, yeah, you're gonna popping. have to heal us again. This thing is knocking us unconscious and kicking our butts. Ow. Got him. Oh, told you. I knew you knew that. <laughs> the thunder spear just... <laughs> finishing blow. That's what I do. I'm the death nail. You do do a lot of finishing blows. <laughs> All right, no more Minotaur. No more freaking Star Platinum Minotaur. At least it wasn't like the snake or something. My spear actually did something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, freaking snake. Mm. 
Isn't it amazing how many different bosses they've thrown at us? Yeah. No. The seed's been stolen! Oh, uh, no. Mamma mia. Oh, Maria. no. Well, now what? They saw an old man. Yeah. Well, now looks like a great time for an escape rope because we've used up all of our resources. Yeah, we're out. Well, the dungeon's empty now, of course. I don't want to walk through that place again. Because as soon as we, as soon as we touch it, just all the enemies clear out going, Oh, oh he touched the center! We all gotta get out of here! We had vastly improved armor. Yep. And we had that much trouble with it. Yeah. The bosses are a little bit broken. A little bit on the difficult side. Not just the boss, the whole dungeon was yep. kicking our butt. Yeah. Well... Um, it's also probably because we're a bit underleveled. Just a bit. Not terribly so, but a bit. Just a tough game. Yeah. Alright, so... I need to purchase new healing items. <laughs> yeah. Because you only get four of each one. Like, at that point, it was like, we're going to have to start eating chocolate to stay alive. <laughs> And that's when you know you're in trouble, is when you're reduced to the, the, the chocolate. high calorie diet. The high calorie, yes, that's right. Well, that's where we end for today. Yeah. Oh, hey, we made good progress. We're yes. Halfway through the game. Yes. We have to go to the ice area again now. Yeah. To continue. Ah! Yes, yes, the final action for today. Upgrade our weapons. The axe. Yep, the upgrades to the armor and the spear, and then we went through that hell and barely survived. Yep, we're just we're just that tough. We haven't even died a single time in this game yet. Oh, it's amazing. I mean, other than the um, werewolf. Nope, never happened. <laughs> never happened. So until next time and every time, this is Hadrix. And Schneider. Signing off. Goodbye. Bye.